Ukrainian forces carry out raid across Dnipro River and broke the Russian defenses. The Institute for the Study of War, ISW, has said Ukrainian forces probably carried out a limited raid across the Dnipro River and landed on Kherson Oblast's eastern bank. However, it is currently unclear whether the Ukrainian military managed to gain ground on the river's left bank. The ISW noted that several Russian mill bloggers stated on the 8th of August that on the eastern bank of the Dnipro River, near the village of Kozachi Laheri, Ukrainian forces landed up to seven boats, carrying six to seven people each, broke through the Russian defences and advanced 800 metres deep. The ISW noted that one of the Russian mill bloggers said the Russian command recently relocated a prepared grouping of Russian airborne personnel from Kozachi Laheri to Zaporizhia Oblast, replacing them with mobilized soldiers weakening the Russian defense in this area. ISW claimed that Volodymyr Zaldo, Russian appointed puppet leader in Kherson Oblast, downplayed the achievements of Ukrainian paratroopers, saying Russian artillery repelled a Ukrainian boat attack. However, the majority of prominent Russian mill bloggers claimed that Ukrainian forces managed to utilize tactical surprise and land on the East Bank before engaging Russian forces in small arms exchanges, and Saldo was likely purposefully trying to refute claims of Ukrainian presence in this area to avoid creating panic in the already delicate Russian information space, the ISW stated. ISW emphasized that they will continue to provide a conservative assessment of the situation on Kherson Oblast's eastern bank until they receive visual confirmation of a long-term Ukrainian presence near Kozachi Laheri or other settlements located on the eastern bank. The ISW noted that they have not yet seen any visual evidence indicating the presence of a significant number of Ukrainian military personnel or equipment near Kozachi Laheri.